the previous episode of Life is Strange. Get that gun away from me, Psycho! No! Whoa! What the fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. <laughs> For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Max, go on. Hey, leave him alone. Max? Chloe? It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait! Is that grass? Tell me the truth. That's an order. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything. Bienvenidos al segundo episodio de Life is Strange. Continuamos. Keep me clean. I still need a shower. Bueno, es hora de continuar con la historia donde la dejamos. Y lo cierto es que el primer episodio me encantó. Ojalá. Ojalá el segundo esté a la misma altura. Y bueno, veo que todas las decisiones que hicimos al principio se mantienen, que es la gracia. Y he visto que teníamos dos mensajes. I could get lost doing time travel research. Warren is blowing up my inbox now. As long as he helps me figure this out. This is so insane, it sounds logical to me. This wormhole thing makes total sense, but doesn't explain how I can do what no scientist ever has. I would say this is some crazy shit, but now I'm not so certain. Thanks, Victoria. I always wanted to be a Max Mean when I grew up. She'll spread that shit everywhere. And I thought I was into Halloween. Dana is not messing around here. Bueno, no parece ni mucho menos. Inmediatamente después, al final del primer episodio, no sé, tiene pinta de que al menos algunos días han pasado. This picture will capture this crazy historic moment in my life. No smiling. Take your power seriously. I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. Parece que estamos 
investigando viajes en el tiempo, nada menos. I could rewind for days and read all of these books. Will I really find any insight into my power? Pues hombre, no tiene pinta de que vayas a encontrar respuesta a lo que te pasa en unos libros, me parece a mí. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Cartier, Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. It would be fun to get some peeps together and play a real game instead of drama games. Bueno, vamos a ir a la ducha, que es lo que decía que necesitaba. Después imagino que podremos hacer más historias por aquí, porque hay un montón de cosas, por lo que veo. Un montón. Pues sí, hombre, al menos han pasado los días necesarios para que se obsesione, bueno, y con razón, con lo que le está pasando. El tema de los viajes temporales, que podemos rebobinar el tiempo. ¿Ahora podemos hacerlo? También podemos, aunque bueno, no vamos a cambiar absolutamente nada. Así que vamos a pillar los trastos para bañarse. Ok, Max, let's hit the showers now. Uh oh, I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. Courtney, seriously? Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. ¿Dónde están los baños? Porque no lo sé. Creo que no los vimos, ¿no? En el primer episodio. Pero por descarte estarán aquí, a la izquierda, vamos, digo yo. Digo yo. Pero qué cojones. ¿Nos dará tiempo a avisarla? Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Bueno, era un rollo de papel higiénico y no estaba hecho con malicia porque ni mira, hombre, con malicia igual era un poco imbécil. Y aquí están los baños. Aunque no sé si estarán las duchas ahí, ¿no? Ah, vale, aquí está, showers. Es que me da miedo hacer algo porque igual luego no podemos mantenernos por aquí. Hombre, en teoría sí, ¿no? Visto lo visto en el primer episodio, deberíamos. Deberíamos. Y bueno, recordemos que... Chloe ha vuelto a la ciudad. Una vieja amiga de Max. Chloe is so determined to find you, Rachel. Y Rachel, otra amiga desaparecida hace seis meses. De hecho, está todo el campus lleno de sus imágenes. Y supongo que en la parte final del juego sabremos algo nuevo de eso. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Um, dice que gracias por defendernos ayer. Pero ahora estoy confuso. No sé si era... La chica... A la que le echa la bronca el padrastro. El de seguridad. O era otra persona. Como lo jugué hace mes y medio... No estoy muy seguro, pero imagino que sería 
otra persona, porque si no ahora mismo estoy un poco perdido. Y bueno, ha dicho ayer. Ha dicho ayer, así que ha pasado un día entre los eventos, no sé. Muy rápido ha llenado su habitación de cosas relacionadas con el viaje en el tiempo. Rachel es una puta, ¿vale? Pues muy bien. Eso es lo que pone aquí. Rachel, recordemos que es la chica desaparecida. Bueno, supuestamente desaparecida. Vale, vámonos dentro. What's up, Kate? School. That's it. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up, and you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yuck! I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Max Selfie thought she was a badass taking that picture. I should have beat her down. That was so uncool. She's jealous because Mark, Mr. Jefferson, knows I'm going to win the Everyday Heroes contest. He thinks Max is a joke. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. <laughs> ¿En serio has creado un dominio para eso? ¿En serio? A ver, vamos a intentar borrarlo. ¿Es that the link to Kate's video? Damn, Victoria is so fucking mean. Even if I can stop one person from watching it. It's worth it. Hombre, era una decisión fácil. No creo que nadie sienta empatía por Victoria. Vamos, eso espero. Tengo las manos pintadas ahora, ¿no? Pues nada. Hello, water. Sorry, I forgot. No, no voy a dar atrás en el tiempo. Ya lo siento mucho. No ha sido tan grave, creo yo. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Ironías de la vida. Otter power? I'm so not there. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Bueno, lo primero sería devolverle a Kate lo que necesita. Hay algo más que coger por aquí. Parece que no. Así que primero vamos a eso. Oh, no fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up? After I find Kate's book. Madre de Dios, esto va a acabar muy mal. Muy mal, madre de Dios. A ver, ¿dónde estará el libro? No book here. 
estará en algún sitio tirado en el suelo, digo yo, si te lo han dejado, seguro que en la estantería no está. My desk is a pigsty, but I know it ain't there. And nothing here. Pues nada. Por aquí entonces. Tada! I do love a clean room. Very zen. Except for that bullshit graffiti. ¿Dónde narices estará el libro? Ah, ahí está. Bueno. Of she just spilled soda on Kate's book. Better fix this fast. Kate needs the book and I don't want to add to our list of problems. Be gone, foul soft drink. Sí, es culpa del refresco. Claro que sí, Max. Ah, you sneaky book. You're mine. Vale, lo tenemos ya. Aunque, bueno, sí, primero vamos a darle el libro y después ya nos preocupamos de esto. Victoria, of course. That's what I get for making fun of her. Bitch. Ha merecido la pena. Mrs. Hoida is still out sick. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. I need to get dressed before I go there. Hombre, ha salido así. Tampoco pasa nada. A ver. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. Bueno, tú qué sabes. Llegará el día en el que en algún juego se pueda ver un movimiento real de la ropa. Aunque sea, no sé, ponerse una chaqueta. No digo más, pero al menos eso. Porque siempre estás fundido a negro. ¿Te vas a poner algo, a quitar algo? Bueno, quitar, se entiende, hasta cierto punto. Pero, no sé, joder. Imagino que debe ser algo complicadísimo, porque eso es algo que yo creo que jamás se ha hecho. Al menos bien hecho. El tema del cambio de ropa. Vale, ¿dónde estará Kate? ¿En serio? Número privado. Eres mala. 40 minutos o si no... Hombre, en este juego no hay hora, así que... No entiendo absolutamente nada. Even with all this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Like no time has passed. A ver, busquemos a Kate. Esta es la de Victoria, donde ya estuvimos en el primer episodio. Ahí está. Kate, you in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Matt. Um, hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I had no choice. David Madsen is an asshole. You had the choice to not get involved. Nobody here seems to care about anybody. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well... He's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. What about this video? And I swear I haven't watched it. I can't even watch it, Max. I won't either. Thank you, Max. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. So, why would you go? Lapse of sanity? I just thought I could meet some new people. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? 
Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Are you sure it was just one sip? I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys, and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. <laughs>